14 News at 9's Ariana Para live in Las Cruces tonight with more on the decision and the book behind the controversy. Ariana. Well, in a six to one vote, the book review committee actually voted to keep that controversial book on the shelves. Now, this meeting lasting over an hour with a seemingly endless line of people waiting to have their voices be heard. This was reaction after the book review committee voted to keep the controversial book on the shelves. Not be removed from the shelves of LCPS school library. That book is Jack of Hearts and Other Parts by Elsie Rosen. It follows a young queer teen navigating his sex life. I'm pretty shocked that they are essentially condoning pedophilia and, you know, adults having sex with children. This book is encouraging teens to abuse drugs and alcohol. Even Sarah Smith and Juan Garcia filed a complaint to the Las Cruces Public School District in August. In a taxpayer-funded school, it doesn't seem like this book has any place. The book is currently on a state-approved list for high school students and was only available at one of the four high schools in the city. I found out that this book was in Mayfield High School. But not everyone at the meeting was against the book. I think they made the right decision. I think it's really important that all students have a wide variety of materials available. I was very pleased to see that the hearing went as it did. The complainants do have the opportunity to appeal the committee's decision, and Sarah Smith tells me she 100% plans to do so. Now, for now, the, the committee's decision will go to the superintendent of LCPS for final approval. Reporting live in Las Cruces, Ariana Parra, KFOX 14 News at 9.